LG is always a hot gift for the holidays, but what do you do with all your old devices? Technology consultant Francie Black is here to show us how we can make some money, which sounds good to me. <laughs> you pay off those Christmas uh, credit cards. <laughs> there you go. And if you're not using it, I mean, you're not going to use the old stuff. So how do we do this? Okay. Well, do you have any sitting around any old phones or tablets? Oh, sure. We've got all kinds of stuff. Yeah. Okay. Well, <laughs> this is my cabinet. This is a history of iPads here. Okay. <laughs> but what you can do, um, there's a lot of options for your phones. You can do trade-ins, you can sell them on Craigslist, you can sell them on eBay. So there's a lot of options, but most of those involve sort of a process or dealing with people or emailing. But there's this great solution that I found and it's called Eco ATM. And what these are is these are kiosks that are located, there's 2,700 of them across the country, including Western North Carolina. I've got the map, I'll show you in a second. Okay. And what you do is, they're, first of all, they're placed in malls, they're placed at Walmart, and they're placed in grocery stores. And you basically, you take your device, Okay, and you charge it, okay. make sure it's got energy, power on it, and you insert it into the device and it asks you questions and you literally get immediate cash. Like, if that's why it's it called ATM. ATM. It is literally like ATM. That's wild. So you put in your device and it analyzes it based on make, model, and condition. Okay, so the better the condition, the newer it is, right. the more you're going to get. Okay. Now you can even put in old broken phones that don't work. Okay. And they're Crash, just going to use them for parts. Or they're something. going to use them for parts, and they say they responsibly recycle them as well. So on something okay. old that maybe that isn't working, you might get twenty bucks. Okay. Now what they found, I actually talked to the company. One of the things they said is a lot of people are even turning in newer devices, even iPhone eights, which just came out a few months ago, right. and they're turning those in, and they guess that they're recycling them and getting the cash, and then applying it toward an iPhone. 10. Ten. <laughs> yep, okay. So on an iPhone 8, that's in excellent condition with 256 gigs, um, you might get something like 420 or $450. Which, okay, about half of what your other one's going to yeah, be. Yeah, okay. and it's literally, they spit it out in cash. So you, there's no hassle. It's super convenient. You don't deal with any people. You don't have to deal with emails. You don't have to ship mail it in. And so you where do we find this? Thing? Okay, so where do you find it? So this is a map. This is actually in Western North Carolina. Oh, okay. is it the mall and at Walmart? On exactly. Airport Road. So yeah, the, right here, the Walmart on okay. Airport Road, and then Asheville Mall, and then there's also down in Greenville, Hendersonville. Where's that? Is that I can't read that. Marion, Marion? I think. Waynesville, Sil Silva. Okay. Yeah. So they're all over. Over. So they're all over Western North Carolina. So take Great. your devices in. And the point what they do is they basically, they take those old devices, and th this company, Eco ATM, actually owns Gazelle, if you're familiar with that particular website. They sell certified pre-owned devices. So they take them, recertify them, wipe them, make sure that they're clean, and then they resell them on their website for less. So it's a great way to transfer those over. The other thing that I talked to them about was security. What if you know you have data on your phone, and sure. how do they identify you? What if it's a stolen phone? And you actually do have to take in your ID when you go to the kiosk. So it takes your ID, and it does actually wipe the data. It, you know, it checks it that you know serial numbers. It records all that information. Okay. So there's some protection there. You're not just putting it in a box and somebody's stealing phones and putting and it in. Right, and getting cash. And getting cash for it. So um, just really great. Um, if you, there's not one near you or you can't get out, the Gazelle website, which is their who they own, Eco ATM owns Gazelle, you can actually do a shipment in if you want to do that and they'll pay for the shipping and all of that. It's a longer process. Okay. The Eco ATM, yeah, but it's an option if you can't get out to an ATM. And so I've got all that information at iPad Wisdom.